Hi guys, this is Shivesh, the beginner guy. In this video, I will show you how you can remove a type of folder virus without any help of antivirus. Please listen carefully and have patience. See, I have inserted a pen drive. I opened it. See this folder named movie. If I try to open it by double click, it is not opening. It is not normal. It is a virus. Now listen, most of the virus comes to your PC when you double click on that virus which is in your pen drive. Although my PC was infected before making this video, but that comes through this double click process. Now see, if I try to format it, all the files gets deleted. But as soon as I open this pen drive, my infected computer creates virus in it. See this, you can delete it, but when you go back and again open it, it will create virus. Your one task is over that you can identify that your PC is infected. Now open task manager. This is applications and this is list of process. If you have opened any software like Chrome, Firefox, my computer, then it will be shown in application and processes related to your computer will be shown here. Now think about it. Things doesn't happen automatically. That virus was created again and again, which means there is a process which creates it every time and that process may be in the process menu. It means in this list one process is definitely a virus. Now instruction for you, whenever you format your computer or reinstall operating system, please note down or memorize all the processes in the list. Because at that time your computer will be fresh with no infection and after some days if it gets infected, you can identify them easily. Now come to the main point. To check the virus, you have to do experiment at very first time. After that you will be habitual. Now I think this console window host is a virus. So right click on it. Open file location. This window opens and this window is in C Windows System 32 and this is a file. It doesn't seem like a virus. Let's see. Try to close it. Nothing happened with my PC. Minimize it. Again format it. Open it. Virus is here. It means that file was not a virus. Also that process was not so important. It was consuming my RAM because it has not affected my computer. Now again come to task manager. See this process desktop window manager. If you will close this process then there will be no icon on your desktop. This is not a virus. Don't close it. This HKCMD module is also not a virus and also not so important. This is not, this is not, this is not, this is not. This window host process seems like a virus in the process. Come back to my computer, format pen drive. Open it again. Oh, that was also not a virus. Come back again, task manager. See, one, two, three, four, same processes. Host process for Windows services. End of this process. Oh God, two more processes has been created. This seems like a virus. Open its file location. Yes, it is not a file. It is a folder of 224 KB and it is in Shiv, my document. Come back to task manager. Now this time click on in the process tree to all the same type of processes. All has closed now. Open my computer, format it. Now open it. See there is no folder. Means now it is confirmed that that file and processes was virus. I got to know the location of virus. Let's see one more step. Look every time when you start computer the virus starts as by default software starts like IDM etc. So it must be in the startup list. So open it. Type M-S-C-O-N-F-I-G and press enter. Boot services startup. That virus should be here. This all looks genuine as its command location is C program dot dot except this one. Its location starts from C user shiv. This is suspicious. Now go to its location C users shiv my document. This is that location which we have found earlier. Now see its location in startup. It is C user shiv app data roaming then Microsoft 
then windows then start menu then see its program startup so i got one more location and it is here also delete it permanently also delete it permanently now we have deleted source file of virus then also you should uncheck it and then click on apply it is not happening as this may be due to i have deleted files click on ok open ms config see the startup item it is not in the list now now i have removed the virus just to restart your system and everything will be normal now this is all about it thanks for your patience this will help you a lot in the future to recognize suspicious processes in your computer thanks for watching goodbye youtube